Maria de Freitas. I'm the owner of the Harrison House Suites, Tucker House Inn, and Coho Restaurant in Friday Harbor, San Juan Island. Today, I'm going to show you how to make a fresh herbed shrimp salad. This is a Mediterranean-inspired dish that's going to be served on a bed of couscous. Then I'm going to have some grilled shrimp on top, and then we're going to top it with some tzatziki, which is a Greek-style style relish. So we're going to make the three pieces, the couscous, the dressing, and the relish, the tzatziki, then we'll go to the grill and we'll do the shrimp and we'll come back and we'll plate the salad. So I'm going to start with the tzatziki. I have some Greek style yogurt here that I've strained in cheesecloth overnight. Okay, to that I'm going to add some fresh cucumber that I've peeled and diced. A little garlic. A little squeeze of lemon, a little vinegar, some dill, a little olive oil, and some fresh pepper. This can easily be made overnight and the flavors will marry quite nicely. So we're just going to let this sit aside while we work on our dressing. So I have roasted some garlic and some olive oil and I reserved the olive oil because I'm going to use that as the olive oil in my dressing as well. So I've macerated or mashed my garlic. I'm going to add a little bit of the olive oil and some lemon. And this dressing is going to go on top of the couscous, so it's going to give it a nice density of flavor. Mm. You can smell the lemon and, and the garlic. And I can add a little bit more olive oil just to give me a little bit more liquid to work with. Okay, and to that I'm going to add some couscous. I've part cooked, actually I've cooked the couscous um, just like rice, one part liquid, one part dry ingredients. I used uh, chicken stock again just to give it some depth of flavor. If you were doing a pescatarian salad and you wanted to keep it just seafood, you can use a vegetarian uh, stock or you could use water. There's plenty of flavors going on here, so I don't think anybody would miss the stock. So we're just going to combine this. And that's our dressing. And then to that, we're going to add some herbs. We're doing a fresh herbed uh, shrimp salad. So I have some thyme, some parsley, some tarragon, and some mint. The mint really gives it that Mediterranean flavor. Okay. And then I'm going to toss in some roasted cherry tomatoes. It's going to be really quite pretty and some Kalamata olives. So I'm going to toss this together. So I'm going to pause right here. We're going to go to the grill. I have my marinated shrimp. The shrimp I've marinated with some olive oil and some fresh herbs, keeping true to our salad. We're going to grill this and then we're going to assemble this really great Mediterranean style salad. So I have my marinated shrimp and I'm going to place them on the grill. And when they have a good sear on them they begin to caramelize. I'm going to turn them over and we'll do the other side. And I'm going to be looking for the color to change right down the middle and have that be almost opaque and then we'll know we'll, they're almost ready. They're almost ready. You can see there's just a little bit of translucent color in the middle. But this one is done. The smaller ones are done. Okay. 
I'll meet you over at the plating station and we'll finish up this salad. So here I have the herb shrimp that we just grilled. It smells really great. And then we're going to put together our salad. I know there was a lot of components, but I promise you it'll be worth it. And you can always feel free to just do two of the components. Grill the shrimp with the tzatziki or the couscous and the shrimp. You don't feel like you have to do the whole thing, and I think you'll still have a very enjoyable dish. I just love Mediterranean flavors so much, I just couldn't stop when I was putting together the recipe. So there's our couscous. I'm going to finish it off with a little bit more parsley. And I have some toasted pine nuts. I waited to put those onto the end so they wouldn't get soggy. And we'll put some tomatoes on the top. And then our shrimp. And then we'll finish it off with a little tzatziki. And then I reserve some, some dill. The dill is looking a little tired, but there we go. And then one last little tomato there. So here's our fresh herb shrimp salad. Bon appetito.